<clears throat> Hello everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Like a Dragon 8. Uh, we just got swindled. Nice honeypot scam. So... Uh, I don't... There's another alley that they were talking about. Uh-oh, I don't know what alley... <clears throat> is it here? Oh, it is. Okay, no, we're fine. We are Gucci. Plus, there's a... I actually didn't know where I was. Wow, my man here is drunk. Oh, right. Pearl, the Pearl Alley. Got it. Now that I saw, <clears throat> saw the name of that taxi stand. That's where that guy Zach told me uh, Marion hangs out. It's called delicious dessert with uh lipstick on there that's her i think headed into the alley like you said what's she up to what's she doing i didn't expect you to be like right here ew hello Remember me? Don't remember you. Never paid you back for the drinks, Emmy. You, uh, nice to see you again, mister. Um, uh, Icky Ben? Nope. No, why, why, why Icky? Uh, Ichiban. No big deal, I guess. Didn't learn your name either, did I, Marion? Would you hear that? Long story. Hey, prick, you harassing Sophia or something? Wow, I, why did I get, like, super uh, protagonist name? Or actually, that was probably more an antagonist voice. Ah. Whoa, whoa. Wait a second. Who's Sophia? Don't play dumb with me now. You got some stones hitting on my lady. You're dead. Are you sure about that, Mr. One Man? Pop. He didn't even get a turn. Pop. Ooh, sheesh. Sophia, huh? How many names does that make? Got a lot to talk about, but first. Mama? I now feel extremely guilty. What's happening? That was scary just now. Who's he? It's all right, baby. Nothing to worry about. This man's a friend of mine. Right? Yeah. Mama? Is he really Marion's kid? Mama needs to have a conversation, okay? You can go home and wait for me like a big boy, Kyle? Doesn't happen in the US. Not like this. Okay. 
Like, especially at night, just, like, send your kid home by himself. I'm surprised this is Zach's fault. Here's about you. He's worried, and he remembers spending your childhood together. Zach doesn't know shit. Huh? Imagine how rich he is. He was born uh, sucking a silver tit. <clears throat> Meanwhile, I was in an accident for a couple of deadbeats. The only reason Zach and I played together as children is because his family moved onto the block next to mine. Probably to redevelop it. She got a real bad outlook. I, I Maybe her life proves that, but like, she got a real bad outlook at what people are like. Uh, I knew from the day we met, we were from two different worlds. Doubt he ever even realized that. Then once I was a little older, my parents insisted I started I start bringing in money the only way I could. Lucky for me, they both wound up back in prison. Of course, by then I had a kid of my own. No clue whose father, or who's the father. Or who his father is, Jesus Christ. Kyle, you mean? Got nothing and no one to rely on, but he still has to rely on me. So yeah, whatever Zach told you I've done, I've done it. To feed my child, I'd do anything. If you came for your money, it's already spent. Don't look at me like that. <clears throat> You've got a, you think I've got some college degree I'm sitting on? I may resent the world I was born into, but I am not sorry for what I've had to do to survive in it. And I don't need one more do-gooder telling me to pull myself up and make a fresh starter. Damn it. Hey, maybe do what you said. Marion. She's right. It's not as simple as turning over a new leaf. At least in Japan, we have some safety nets like Hello Work. Some places just spit you out and exactly, or expect you to sink or swim. No. Get how hard it sucks to be looked down on when you're trying to make it to another day, but this road never ends well. You can justify anything by saying it's for your child. Just because it's defensible doesn't mean it's right. Nah. Even if you avoid jail time, how long is it going to be before your son grows up and blames himself for what you went through? Look, I have no right to tell you what to do. I grew up in a different world, too. And even at my lowest, I had people I could count on. Also, I have a friend named Kiryu who used to work, run a cabaret club. Would you like to join? No, it's true. Nothing better will ever come from all this. I don't want to raise another person like me who can't even afford to hope. Only, I don't know what else I could do. <clears throat> Kasuga! Hey, glad you finally made it. It's good to see you, Marion. Zach. I didn't know. About your boy. <laughs> so goddamn sorry, Marion. Stop. Why are you apologizing? You're not responsible for any of this. Couldn't see it. You were being marched into hell by your parents, and I was too stupid to even notice. I thought you just become some teenage delinquent. I thought if I could get through to you, it'd be like it was before. But uh, I'm so ashamed of myself. I should have tried harder to understand. Could have helped you. No, don't you fucking say that you could have helped me. These were my problems to endure, not yours to throw money at. My parents took my choices away from me once. Uh, you can't fix me by doing the same thing. Yeah. Maybe I can't. But I could be here while you fix things yourself. Huh? What? Can't change our past, but sometimes with help, we can change our futures. Even when it seems like nothing better will ever come your way. I mean, it's not going to be easy, but if you want to do this, turn yourself in and you can still have a life. No, my boy. My boy. Kyle needs me. I know he does. So let me look after him until you're back. You? A teacher, you know. Kids are my specialty. I promise I'll take care of them and I won't let him forget you for a moment. We'll move into my parents' house. Uh, my mom would love having him around, I'm sure. <laughs> Sounds like it's a pretty good deal. Really, kinda isn't, actually. She gets fucked over like crazy and, like, loses her kid at the very least temporarily. 
and he gets like all the benefits. Like, I don't know if it's a real good deal. Do call Marion. Basically, thank you both. I never really believed anyone had this kind of compassion. Exactly. Like, this feels very manipulative. Since I was old enough, it only ever seemed like for uh, one person to win, another one had to lose. I thought I could make it. Uh, if those were the rules, then I had Kyle. I don't want him to have to live that way. I keep having this nightmare where he comes to me in the dark. I see his eyes and he asks me, What have you done, Mama? Marion. He has a right to hear an answer that won't cause him pain. Ishiban, Zack, maybe I can actually give him one. Give me a little more time, alright? To sort everything out? So. Of course. Tell me when you're ready and I'll be here. Y yes and no. Uh, this one kind of doesn't seem like it's money related. Um, but he's like... He... He's white knighting his way into trying to get the girl. Like, I will do all of this stuff for you while you go rot in prison. Exactly. Exactly. It's just kind of, like I said, this... The music is supposed to try and be like, oh, this is sweet. But really, like, it does feel kind of manipulative. And like, hey, you're going to jail. Turn yourself in. I'll watch your kid. I don't know how long you're going to be gone. And then when you get out, like, I'm expecting you to come back to me and get your child, which means I will see you again. Yeah. And the, the only other thing that I could see happening there is him being like, hey, he's experienced what, like, good can be. Good? Hey, why don't you experience what good can be as well? I don't know. It, it, it feels gross. This is a, a really a kind of a gross sub-story. Okay. That's all we can do for now. Hope Marion can make the next step. Like, why was the suggestion turn yourself in? Like, for what? <laughs> um... I, I have that, I have that, I have that. So I have the three sub-stories that I'm used to seeing. Uh, I don't have another one. Oh yeah, there's that too. Uh, that's, I actually did want this one. Uh, I guess this is all just time? Huh. Okay. Yeah, having her not know anything really about him is, is a whole other ordeal. Woo! Hell yeah, cake. Although, cake isn't necessarily my, my favorite, but uh, a lot of the times... The cakes that I've had have been like the store bought ones, and they're always really dry. A uh, a cake that isn't dry usually tends to be pretty good. Yeah, that's odd. I mean, it kind of makes sense in a way, but kids are your specialty in a teaching aspect. But yours is from scratch? Okay. Yeah, I, I have no doubt yours is good. Because especially with your... Your knowledge of cooking. Uh, and baking, for that matter. I know you 
Puff's talked a lot about some of the things that you've made, and it's like, oh, that sounds so good. Um, but, like, you... Your specialty is teaching kids, being able to talk to them. Do you have a kid of your own? Because raising a kid is very different. I, truly, I wouldn't know. I Do you see a kid around here? But... I don't know if that's a lot or a little. Especially because I also don't know how much cake is being made. There's context that I'm missing. Uh, I think... Okay. Then... Yeah, okay. That's... <laughs> That sounds super sweet, then. Uh, I think right now, if I'm just giving time for her to think, then I guess we're just going to go back to here. Uh, take half a cup? Okay, yeah, that's drastically different, then. How's it, my man? Eh. Now, granted, those are brownies in comparison to icing a cake. Or, and to me, brownies don't have remotely as close to as much frosting on them. But that could also just be the way, the way that I've had them. Roger that. Beat it. My mom makes brownies that really don't have, like, any frosting on them. There, there it's technically is. But it's, um, I don't know how she makes them, but it's a, like I said, I think it's a, a thin layer of frosting that she might put back in the oven because when they come out there, it's cracked. And I don't know if that's a frosting on there, if that's just the top of the brownie. Um... Oh, wow. Yeah, because coffee is going to be bitter. Yogurt kind of has a, a little bit of bitterness to it. Yeah, that might make sense. That, that sounds really interesting. Uh, what do I have for money? $300. Eh, it's not worth putting it into the bank. Putting into the ATM. Like 500? Maybe. But. <laughs> Alright, Kiryu. Let's take a nap. Oh. Let's all, all of us cuddle. Hi. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah, it's... It does look good, though. For someone who's not, like, super stoked about chocolate, it does look good. Oh, <laughs> What's weird about me is I am one who tends to like more plain shit. Like vanilla, fucking love. <laughs> like cheese pizza, hell yeah. I think there are specifically, I don't know why I keep interrupting, talking about food. Specifically with pizza, I think there are pizzas that put way too much on. So... That's a big reason why I think I'm like, just give me like a cheese pizza. Plus, it's a good way to uh, t 
test out different places. Like, if you fuck up a cheese pizza, like, doesn't matter what toppings you put on it. Like, the rest of, like, everything goes on top of a cheese pizza. Hey, <laughs> あ、そう知るのかしらから伝わってるはずだ。顔も知ってるのかな見れば一番だって気づいてくれる why this music for that? ちゃんが何か始まりますよ。どうかしたのか。ちちゃんが何か思いついたみたいで。それで私たちは思いつける限り、茜さんの行方を追った。茜さんの家に茜さんの勤める養護施設。それに茜さんがやってた奉仕活
どうせお前何言ったらいいか分かんねえだろうからよあならカンテも用意しねえとな<笑>やるからには目指す100万再生だなんなら金盾も狙っちゃうかえ you mean like a golden play button? なんだよくわからねえが面白そうだな俺に何かやれることはねえかあいやいやキリュウさんは安静にしといてくださいよ You have cancer, just sit the fuck out なめられたもんだご隠居扱いされるほど俺は衰えちゃいねえぜえどうすっかなじゃああじゃあキリュウさんにお願いしたいことがありますこれはもうキリュウさんにしかできないやばい仕事っすよ It's gonna be something that's really mundane, isn't it? It's gonna be like holding a microphone. Oh my god, it might actually be holding a microphone. From the, the trailers. Yep. Yep. Also, that's not a, really a shotgun mic. Oh, yeah. Several splashes? Oh, boy. That's gonna be a lot of vanilla. <laughs> that would, yeah, I assume that that would be really good to help try to counteract the chocolate. Yeah, Kiryu doesn't fuck around. ほら、もう動画撮ってるから、どんどん喋って。文字サイズ大丈夫だよな。とにもかくにも、茜さんの目に止まらねえとしょうがねえ。茜さんのことを行き別れの息子が探してますってとこをバッチリアピールしてくれ
本当は見せびらかすようなもんじゃねえがちょっとでもあかねさんに近づくためだ仕方ねえどうだいこいつはインパクト的に Uh, obviously, there are people who are taking pictures. It's just a fucking tattoo. Although, motherfucker's pretty jacked, though. Ohatsuni <laughs> In it. Yeah, I mean, all the tattoos in these games are so well done. よろしくお頼み申しますふん古いの知ってるアンライクミーカンテムシして好き勝手喋んなよだが、せっかく作ったのにいいんじゃないこっちの方がバズりそうさて背中の流魚が申しますとおり私元極道の半端者母を訪
Hey, hey. hey, I've got just the guy to edit. He was in a wheelchair. I forget his name, but he was in a wheelchair at the beginning of the game. Since, uh, I mean, he didn't really die. <laughs> Him doing the Daidoji stuff. Uh, to me, it's not so much that that part he's been more jokey and lighthearted. I think it's just him being around uh, Ichiban. Because Ichiban will pull that type of personality out of you, I think. So that the man. Thank you, Kasuka. Yes. Oh! So, this is the one that I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to I don't know if he swore him off. Um, he did almost die, I would think. Think he was... He was, uh, there with... Or trying to find Tomisawa. She... She might be. I feel like that would be a weird... Uh, I don't feel like the uh, Like a Dragon Yakuza games would to make that much of a twist. Would she die in the game? Maybe. I do see that part happening, but I don't know if that would just be a... Um... Off-screen type of thing. <gasps> Turtle! <laughs> まさかこんなところで出会えるとはな。こいつは国に保護してされてる超レアな亀だ。売れるとに売れば次いい金になる。うん。Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Uh, haven't really played Animal Crossing. I know that that's a big, or that's a part of the game. And I can only assume that it's coming up soon, because we're chapter six, and we've not unlocked that yet. So, I have a feeling I'm going to put some time into it. It just may not be on stream. I'll do some of it on stream. Oh, yeah. I mean, we, I've already gone through the Pokemon stuff, so... I know this has Pokemon and... Uh... <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a... Uh... This this game is gonna be, like, 100 hours of actual Yakuza stuff. Uh, or Like a Dragon. And then it's gonna be another 300 hours just of... Dodonko Island, or however it's pronounced. Yeah, let him fucking be! He's just chilling. Oh, okay. Are we talking Animal Crossing or are we talking this? I'm gonna guess Animal Crossing. Um, I'm on my own. Uh, oh, they're level 18. We're, we're fine. We're more than fine. Did that motherfucker only do like five damage to me? <laughs> I was thinking about at least trying Suji Mancer. <coughs> um, I wanted the Desperado uh, 
because I thought it looked cool. I have Chitose as Tennis Ace. I have Kiryu as uh, Action Hero. Also, the book is upside down. That's funny. Uh, I And I have Tomizawa as Pyromancer. I was going to do the football one for Ichiban, but I'm like, I don't see him as a tank. And the football one is a very tanky class. ふう。大丈夫かい、亀ちゃん。はい。助けてくれてありがとうございました。え、亀が喋った。亀じゃないです。僕ですよ。It's Gumby. What? 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 Uh, yeah, the stats were one thing. The other thing at the time was I didn't have anyone who was really high in uh, uh, magic or mana or whatever the f mental points, I think is what they call it in this game. Um, everyone else was really, was primarily into like physical damage. So I was like, I want someone with that on a higher level. And at the time, all I had really was Pyromancer for that. Oh, okay. From the side, I kind of like him. From the front, not so much. Good timing for that. And Ichiban is now. Uh, there's a lot of magic that has, or a lot of abilities that have are more that don't have like a weapon part. Geo dancer. Remember that one. Solely magic focused. Mm -hmm. uh, even the dialogue, the dialogue's different. Oh, yeah, and uh, I could see. Uh, um, I can see Chitose with it, but like, I wanted her with the tennis one. Please don't tell me I I took a loan from you and now I oh god. Oh boy. Do I owe you a bunch of money now, randomly? It kinda, yeah. I can I bet they will. I just laugh at the fact that they went so far as to change the dialogue box. I know who you were talking about. When you said the Philadelphia Flyers, it's like, uh, oh, yeah, okay. I know which mascot you're talking about. Oh, 
供たちから大人気だったんですぞ。Oh boy. So, Ka, Mazotone, Wargatara, Bakemonotoga, Chimate, Kudatara, Udorichimateo. Daya, each day is o t o the Uarinia, Sabiretil Tuga. True. Gomidaraka, pretty as boy. He's a, he's a mascot, all right. Are? Sma. What's the matter, trainer? What do you go to Kichimatagana? Legal dumping. Adosha Matayashi. Kano don't go to no now, she must say. Atashina Nakama Tuskete Grete. Arigato Gosamasta, Kasgasa. Oh, Konoshima no owner, Zanka. Yoroshina Kasta Konoshima. Did I not say something? If I didn't say it, I meant to. Oh, ですそのうち遊びに来ているお客さんにまで危ないことをするようになってったんだよ。this is a very different game right now. Oh, yeah. I get that. It looks like it looks like it's kind of a dinosaur. Ah, Fuku looks like just a, a mascot. まあでも無理なのかな。今も不法投棄は続いていて、私たちがどんなに処理をしても追いつかない。私たちも諦めて、この島を出て行った方がいいのかも。It's <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the fucking googly eyes. そうだね。悪い悪い。ごめんね。あ、恩人に暗い話ばっかりしちゃって。えっと、あ、せめて今日くらい明るくやろうよ。そうですな。<laughs> Am I actually a guest? You did take me. You brought me here. Kinoko Uh, regardless, I'm not exactly a guest. I'm more of a forced guest at that point. I didn't come here out of my own free will. Uh, I guess I conked out after the party. Man, what a night. Ah, oh, crap. What's going on with Chichan and them? Are they waiting on me? Better give them a call. No service, I bet. Oh, 
Oh shit, there's service. Oh, Ichiban, what's up? <laughs> I love that both dialogues are different. It just kind of shows that like we're in a completely separate different or different part of the game. <coughs> Chichan, hi, so uh, sorry a lot's happened and long story short, I'm over at a resort called the Dunko Island right now. Dun 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 what? You don't make any sense. Uh, I know. I just want to give you a heads up that it's going to take me some time to get back. Oh, okay. No worries. I'm going to need a few more days myself to finish editing the video. F days? What are you doing to the video? You are? Huh. I don't think it would take that long. I mean, we want this video to take over the internet, right? Um... I feel like this is a trap of a question. <laughs> I know they want it to go viral. I don't think... The viral is the, uh... Is Ichiban's performance. Um... If it's not the trap answer that I think Booba is... Uh... I don't. Nope. I have no idea what those things are. Uh, anyway, don't feel bad about taking the time to kick back and relax on... Uh, what was it? Dodonko Island? Uh, I'll reach out once I'm done. Gotcha. I'll leave it in your hands then. No pressure. Boy. Uh, well, I guess she won't be finished for a few more days, so I'll just take it easy and look around the island for now. This place is fucking trashed. This place is seriously a dump. Uh, makes a lot more sense now, but I still feel bad for them. Uh, for the island, too. You want to repay them for letting me stay. <laughs> Good lord. Uh, maybe I can do something about this trash. Where do I start? Never handled garbage like this before. I want to make things worse. Might not be the way, but hey, it's my way. Uh, break trash. Hold the bat, swing the bat. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like how breaking this um fun. is how you get rid of it. Oh, just done. Okay. I don't like either one of them, truth be told. That's fair. That's a very fair. <laughs> Big purple dinosaur. ワイルドだろ。すごすぎる。カスガさんがいれば、もしかしたらこの島もあれあれ、おかしいな。俺たちからのプレゼントがなくなってるみたいだけど、どうしたの？なあ。<笑> Why? I don't know what they're saying, but why is one of the words that he's saying cream pie? At least is what it sounds like to me. I, again, I don't know what the actual word he's saying or what the 
translation is to what's coming on here, but I've heard it twice now. そして<笑> Mm. Why? I recognize what that is. I remember that from uh, uh, from Duolingo. Ah, yes. Like, I can't remember what it translates to, though. I cheated. Too late. It's been a while. Like, it, it, I need to get back into it. I, I think I said this last week, too. What? No. It, it's been... Uh, I've forgotten a lot of what I've learned. Yeah, I, I when I looked it up, I saw Good Evening. I was like, oh, right, okay. Uh, y yes. I'm going to answer yes and why. <laughs> call me a loser? That's rude. Ooh, fucking dropped a hard pal. こんなゴミ島に宿泊してるって<笑> That one is Nice to meet you, I'm Michaela, right? Hey, I did remember. <laughs> That one I didn't look up. I do. I did vaguely remember those are Yoda Oshiku, which I my mouth did not want to make that sound right there. It's like seven syllables. Yeah, I mean, I can, um, eat the dakimas. Yeah, that one, I mean, that's, um, what, thank you for the food or something like that. Um, as for, like, translation, that makes sense if you could say the word. <laughs> like, that's a hard one. Uh Yeah, because it's, I know most of the time when you've seen it, it's usually, um, when you get the food and before you actually eat. It's usually like, thank you for the food, thank you for the meal. Uh, bless this food. Yeah, I can see that. There's, it's like a lot of things with, or a lot of different sayings is it could have different connotations of it. 
Uh, enemy attacks can be dodged by uh, pressing R2. Hold. Okay, so just hit square, hold square, or... Uh, oh, yeah, you just wait on him for the cake. Let's eat... Yeah, I can see that, too. I've always taken it as showing gratitude, like you kind of brought up, showing gratitude for the food. Um, so, yeah, press or hold square and then R2. You gave me two guys to fight and I had a bat. Also with the uh <clears throat> with Duolingo, when uh you're having to like not spell necessarily because it's all still in uh, the Roman letters, um, trying to spell out. Actually, no, because it's it's the kanji with the Roman letters below it to show the pronunciation. Trying to spell out Doza Yoroshiku, I remember was like, how do you spell that? There's so many letters here. Started writing hiragana. Um, I I've been where I stopped was starting to learn or going through kanji and uh i was doing pretty well at that the worst ones were trying to remember how to draw the characters because there were a number of times where i maybe i took a long enough break out of it and i just didn't remember uh he'd have gonna Uh, don't they have katakana as well? I thought they added or they had katakana on there as well. Ah,また殴られずに済みました。あいつら、今までにもあんたを。あ、はい。<laughs> Okay, so instead of Kiragama, it should be Katakana. Yeah, that's the one that's like, one character stands for like, different words. Like, full-on words. If I remember. I don't remember Hiragana, what that stands for. Yeah. Oh, right, Japanese. Interesting. Might be a good thing to pick up. Oh,そんな。カスガさんが責任感じることないですよ。それに、この島にいても何もないし、楽しくないでしょうし。何もないなら。作ればいいじゃねえか。え、昨日言ってただろう。この島を一大リゾートにするんだって。だったら、この後に何とかして人が泊まりたくなるような設備とか作っ。Okay, I can see that. Um right called right Japanese. Do you know the developer for it? Also, do you have an iPhone or an Android? Because that could also change what's on the store. Theo, 
Android? Okay, good. Then, yeah, do you have the full name of it? Because I, I don't know if I'm seeing just uh, an app called Just Right Japanese. Uh, that helps, actually. Write it, Japanese. Okay, yep. I see the one. Downloading! Downloading! <laughs> I'll be spending some time here. Don't worry. Maybe off stream, but I'll be spending some time here. Uh, I think I've seen it. Um, all right, so I did say I'd help restore the place, but uh, you guys got some kind of gold mines. Oh, god, uh oh, the goal, you say? Yeah, I think it'd be easier to go about things if you guys had a clear cut vision, you know, rather than trying to restore things all willy nilly. Oh, I see. Actually, there's this old dream of mine. Ooh. Oh, yeah? About this. Oh. Shoot for the stars. Get funding to build the five-star resort of your dreams. What's all this about? See, a government-backed group called the Resorts and Tourism Association is running this here campaign. As long as you meet their criteria, the association will grant us some funding. Damn it, that's basically what you need right now, isn't it? So what do we got to do? Jeez. Um... Well, quite a few things actually, but the main two criteria are popularity and satisfaction. Uh, what does that mean for us? Hi. Well, popularity is pretty straightforward. Get people to like the island. The more popular it gets, the more visitors we'll receive. And if our island's popular enough with folks, we'll be able to get our name out there. Satisfaction is a quantitative measure that represents how pleased the guests are with the island. You can build facilities or furnish the island to improve overall satisfaction. If it's too low, there's no way we'll be acknowledged by the association. In short, if both popularity and satisfaction are high enough, we could pass the evaluation and receive funding. So that's how all this works. I had no clue. The association rates resorts anywhere from one to five stars, five stars being the highest rating a resort can earn. And someday I'd love for Dodonko Island to be a five-star resort as well. <laughs> that sounds doable. Does it, Kasuka? Uh... We just gotta work hard to aim for five stars. So, uh, how many stars do you guys have right now? Zero. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, we haven't even been acknowledged yet. Uh, yeah, should have figured. Let's try aiming for one star for now. What's it gonna take to get there? This much, I'd wager. Okay. Clear out the entrance, clear out the great tree. Uh, popularity up 700 and satisfaction up to 1,000. All right, time for a boost in popularity and satisfaction. One star rating, here we come. Hey, Dodonko a go go. Do you want to gain popularity? Yeah, that is true. Uh, so if you want to gain popularity and raise satisfaction, we just have to build things and install them, right? Right, but there's not much on this island aside from trash and the like. I don't even have money or a girlfriend. <laughs> Oh, yeah, no, I don't think I've seen this one. Is 
the hair back. Should tie it back. Yeah, that's funny. Is Puffs there still that long? I forget. I forget if he said he uh, cut it or not. Also, this man right here. I don't even have money or a girlfriend. That's totally irrelevant. Uh, if we don't even have money to buy furnishing, we just have to make it ourselves. There's plenty of wooden stones, so why not use them as materials to craft something new? Ah, okay. Yeah, speaking of materials, when I was cleaning up the trash and breaking it down, I found some parts that could come in handy. Maybe we can uh, make even more things with these too. <laughs> Using trash as crafting materials to make new furnishing? How eco-friendly! So sustainable. Sounds feasible to me. I'm big on DIY myself, you know? Let's do it. Yeah, I, w I miss having my longer hair too. Um, I miss having hair to an extent, but like this is where I, where I was at when I started shaving it. Uh, it was It was too thin for what I wanted. Oh, we got the materials then. Gravitated to a beard. Yeah. Yeah, the beard has definitely grown. N not to mention the fact that through COVID, I started experimenting with getting this just all longer to begin with. And like try and f experiment with it to see what I like. And right now, I kind of like where it's at. Oh, really? I was going to say he does in the... The karaoke video oh um i have no idea it's what's funny i was talking about this with mini too and uh, i was like it looks so cool it takes up so much room <laughs> like i can't justify the amount of room it takes up but then again that's also me in this situation banda has like a whole setup that it works i would say it would work perfectly with uh beach over there has some things that can be used as raw materials follow me and i'll show you exactly apart from his pup but let's start with a basic uh, wooden stone, the one, the ones that look like this can be broken, what, oh, sorry, the ones that look like this can be broken with a bat. Find some stones and, uh, trees in the area and break them down, then, uh, bring back five wood logs and five stones. That's true. Like, yeah. In the meanwhile, I'll go prep what we need to get started with DIY. Once you're done gathering materials, come and see me and at the <laughs> DIY stand. Find me a girlfriend while you're at it. <laughs> Just kidding. But please. I'm so alone here. Ah, uh, no idea. With your trusty bat, you can smash junk piles, trees, and rocks to gather resources for your DIYs. Collect cloth, iron, plastic, glass, and semi- Fucking semiconductors. Everything else is kind of like a basic thing and then semiconductors uh, from junk piles and uh, naturally collect wood from trees, stones from rocks. Remember to grab those resources as they crop up every day. Okay. 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 This part here reminds me of the farming thing in uh, uh, Ishin. Put time in for October. I, here's the problem. I don't know the week. <laughs> like, I need to know a day. I know I, I found out it was October, but I don't know when. Um, but having this the whole menu change first week. Oh, remind of tonight. Okay, yeah. If he gives me a confirmation. Uh, of a weekend, I'll start looking at 
uh, looking at some stuff. Um, but yeah, having this menu here reminds me of the farming part of Ishin. Oh yeah, I did uh, hear that. Um, so we're over an hour in this episode. I think. I don't know if I'm going to be doing this all next episode. Um, I might. Like, truthfully, I might, if I can do that. Was it a fan of Ishin? I thought it was fine. It's it's a departure from most of the other games. But I thought... Um, I thought it was a unique way to teach some sort of history even though there's it's not completely accurate because it's still a game but there's definitely tr actual history involved with this um how many yakuza i think it's just lost judgment and then it, i have it but if i really want to play it um that would be for the memes, but it would be Fist of the North Star. And then Mario? I don't I don't actually know. Um I have I have a lot of games. Actually, now that I think about it, right? I have Alan Wake 2, eventually. I've already done Banjo Kazooie. Okay. You know what? That's that's fair. But also not. Because <laughs> that's just the English naming for it. I've already done Banjo. <laughs> I already streamed it. I also did Banjo Tooie. Um. Again. <laughs> no. <laughs> um. Here. You know, we'll talk about this in a second. I'm going to end the video. So for those of you who are watching on YouTube, uh, thank you all so much for watching. I'm Blurry Phoenix in Game On.